they need to look like you're doing something so your clinical instructor doesn't get mad, but you don't know like what to do with yourself. So let's talk about some things that you could do during this period of time. One thing I would do is, is the chart is a great place to review things and you could check out, hey, what medications are they on? What kind of history do they have? One, one thing I like to do is when I have a patient who's been admitted, I like to go back to the emergency department note and see, oh, what, did, what, how did they come into the hospital? What exactly did them getting to the emergency department look like? You can offer to help the CNA. So if there's a CNA on the unit, hey, can I, I know you're getting ready to do vitals. You want me to go around with you and help you? I'd love to do that just to get some more reps in. They would love that. Another thing you could do is you could round, let the CNA know or the nurse, hey, I, I think I'm going to go around the unit and like, like check rooms and see if I can clear out trays and I can document the intake and output. You know, do you think that would be okay? And then, and then if they say yes, then what I would do is I would go into every room, see if there's any old trays from like a different a meal, which I feel like that gets forgotten a lot and document okay did whatever percentage of the food they ate um, how much they drank put that in the chart that's going to give you some more practice tidy up the room a little bit and that's going to really help people out